Hi all, this is Sia Naz and welcome to episode 48 of the Diary of Sia Naz. So it's been a while, um, I've been ill, I'm still trying to get my voice back. I'm going to try not cough too much, I'm feeling a bit more settled today. So I uh, thought I'd just get back at it, um, getting a bit bored of doing nothing. Um, but um, things have been happening, um, so what I thought I would do is the um go back to uh, the last week that I was supposed to do um a podcast and sort of combine all the Mondays together to give you um a rundown of what I've been doing even though I've been ill um I've been doing some things I've been buying stuff um when you're bored at home you shop or you go on Twitter or Instagram and you see stuff no, they're very good at catering the ads to what you what you like. And since I've been um, enjoying a lot of makeup stuff, there's been a lot of makeup ads on my Instagram feed. So, of course, I'm getting sucked into that. Um, so let's get started. So Monday the 4th of November was when I was supposed to do the last podcast. So on that Monday... Um, I uploaded the last podcast that I did. Oh, and it says here that it was pouring rain, so I'm looking at my purple fluffy llama diary. So on the 4th of November it was raining and I also uploaded my podcast. And then the Monday after, Monday the 11th of November, that was Remembrance Day. So that's to remember the end of World War One and all those soldiers that died in battle and have died in all battles since then so it's to remember all those and um thank you so much to for the service of all soldiers um and all those who have um passed now our hearts are with um the families um so that's quite a brave thing to to do to be a soldier very brave and then um this monday i finally got the conspiracy palais palais palette um, very unorganised. <laughs> so I've got the palette here. I didn't know if, if I was going to be talking about this. So I got one. Very lucky. I don't know why I I got one. And there's so many others who who missed out. And um, uh, I just sort of got caught up in the buzz, like I've said before. And um, so this came this Monday, and I'm wearing. I'm getting some of the colours. I don't know how people get the colours so vibrant. I kept it quite muted anyway because I'm not feeling the best and I didn't really want to have hugely bright colours on. But um, next week I really want to try the Trisha and like to sort of pack it on and see if I can get the colours like everyone else is getting them. So it is an amazing palette. And today, of course, is Sunday. So where's my calendar? Is the 24th of November. Um, was it today? Was it yesterday? No, it was yesterday that they had the last episode of The Beautiful World of Jeffree Star. So I just want to see more and more and more. I just love them so much. But, um, yeah, this is the palette. Conspiracy. And the beautiful colours inside. I'm going to try and avoid you seeing my room. <laughs> Um, oh, let's, oh, let's do this. <clears throat> that's better. <laughs> so that's the box. And there's the colours. And, um, mm, not really doing them justice, but the colours are really beautiful. And the palette is really quite big. I don't think people realise it's quite big. And the colours are really big. Like each eye shade is quite big. And the ones I went for was Cheese Dust. cheese dust and um just a theory which is a lovely sort of um you can't see you can't see it properly it's a lovely um sort of golden a golden color golden brown it's lovely golden brown and a bit of ranch which is a white uh -uh. Ranch. <laughs> I have to go the opposite way. Ranch. And 
Yeah, mainly cheese dust, just a theory, a ranch. Oh, and diet cola. I love these names. I'm so used to having like serious makeup. It's nice to have something fun. Um, but yeah, I really want to try and get them a bit more bold um, next week. But yeah, I'm thrilled to have it. I think the, the colours are amazing. The consistency is beautiful, lovely, um, rich sort of velvety texture. Um, yeah, and I've just loved the whole series. I think a lot of us that have been keeping up with it, just falling in love with everyone. Um, and just feel like you're a part of the journey. And, and it's, it's more than just like an eye palette. Like you've been part of the journey and part of everything that they've been doing. So... They've done a brilliant job and apparently it's like the biggest release in cosmetics history and I'm not surprised by that. But um, I've loved every minute of it and I wish it would continue. But the colours are amazing. The palette is amazing. I mean, there are people that are hating, but if you're hating, you just don't understand. Um, it's it's like a, a whole package. It's not just the product. It's everything that we've been through, everything in the series. So... Now, people that are putting reviews up saying they don't like it, you know, get lost. So anyway, there it is. And the lovely cover on the box that you can't see, there's too much. So that came on Monday. I haven't even touched it really. I'm too scared to use it, but I did use some of it. Um, so, and today is the first day that I've put any makeup on. Um, and the lipstick that I've got on is um, a Chloe and Kylie collaboration. I think this one is called Allergic to Bullshit. It's that one or it's um, uh, Bigger the Hoops. It's one of those two. Um, so that was Monday. That's all the Mondays. So all the Tuesdays. So um, the 5th of... <coughs> Excuse me. The 5th of November was Melbourne Cup, but um, usually every Melbourne Cup we always bet, but um, I've boycotted it now, um, the way they're treating the horses and um, there's a lot of bad things happening around um, horses and Melbourne Cup. You know, everything's sort of like losing its sizzle. <laughs> um, I also finished the YouTube um, the video I'm guessing on the podcast and I worked on the lyric video um, and then the other the following Tuesday I was sick all day but I got the Shane Dawson makeup bag <laughs> you can see how prepared I am the makeup bag it's huge like that's that's a massive makeup bag it doesn't have the swinging piggy on it like some like one of the other bags does, but um, I got this off Beauty Bay. Um, one of the other um, websites is selling it a bit cheaper, fifty five dollars in Australia. But I got this one. I got this one for sixty, but I got it for a discount. I had a promo code or something else. But this is where I keep all my makeup now. So when I do my makeup, <laughs> like it takes me an hour, and I've got like I've just got everything in here. Like all the concealer sticks and all the concealers and um, the NARS blush and banana cream. And of course, I've got all the cheapy sort of makeup. Um, but you know what? Cheapy is good too. And the Kylie Queen drip is my favourite. Um, it's a highlighter, but it is gorgeous. Trying not to show you too much of my room. Um... And, you know, that I'm sitting on an angle today. I've just been very lazy. Usually I turn my desk around, but I'm actually sitting to the side of it. And I look huge. I don't know if it's my jumper. I'm trying not to show you the stains on my jumper. Oh, and I've got this. I don't know if people have seen this. It's um, It helps you with the contour. So you put it, I wonder if this one's better. You put it on your ear. And then you hold it to your cheek and then it helps you, um, guides you where you to put the contour. The camera just froze and it better not cut out. I'm not in the mood for it. Um, Napoleon, my um, 
highlighter, like under the eyes. What's it called? Concealer. So I just I just put everything in here, and then when I do my makeup, I just stand near my mirror, and then I just grab everything because I've got a drawer where I've got everything in there. So instead of like walking backwards and forwards, like my mirror is over there and the drawer is over there. So instead of walking backwards and forwards, I just put everything in my bag and then um, I don't have to keep going backwards and forwards. I've got all the concealer, um, all the foundation, everything's in here. But it's really cute. I wish I could show you like more detail. Can you see? Oh, there we go. Oh, that's upside down. The piggy and the star. It's pretty cool. Like, that's really cool. Okay, stop admiring what you've got. Um, makeup bag. That was Tuesday. So this Tuesday I don't think I did anything because I haven't written anything in. So then going to Wednesday, 4, 5, the 6th of November. I uploaded my YouTube video and I promoted it. Um, the following Wednesday, oh, I got a Charlotte Tilbury um, highlighter, fashion. This is how disorganized I am. I'm going to run and get it. It should be more organized. Check that out. It's got um, Swarovski crystals on it. And it looks nice on the screen, but in person it looks quite cheap. Like when you see it here... It looks kind of cheap and nasty, but it looks good there. And inside is the um, the Hollywood, what's it called? Film Star Bronze and Glow. Film Star Bronze and Glow. I'm trying not to show you too much of my room. Film Star Bronze and Glow. I've got too much lighting. Oh, you can still see my room. I haven't, I haven't used it yet either. Um, I just use my cheapy concealer and highlighter. But it works for me. And um, I've got a guide. You can see the guide. <laughs> um, so that was on the 13th of November. The Wednesday. Oh, and this Wednesday on the 20th of November, I saw the movie Last Christmas. And it is lovely. I really love Emma Thompson. Um... And uh, Andrew Ridgely is in it. Spoiler alert. Um, if you know who Andrew Ridgely is, great. If you don't, look him up. Um, and that was really nice. The ending was totally unexpected. So it's always nice when you've got something like that. So I went and saw that with my sister. So that was awesome. And then Thursday... Uh, Thursday on the 4, 5, 6, seven, on the 7th of November, I started on an Elvis remake um, of the song um, Flame. Um, uh, Anne-Marie was her name, the latest Flame. I think Anne-Marie, something like that. So I, I started that from ages ago and I thought I'd just go back to it. I'm just trying to find songs that I've almost finished or halfway there. And I'm just like reworking on them, but because I got really sick, I haven't been able to sit and concentrate. And that's been the worst part of being ill. I just can't sit and think because I just don't feel well. So I'm um, starting to feel a lot better now so I can concentrate a bit more. Um, and then the following um, Thursday, sick as a dog, but I did shopping, like when there's nothing in the house and I'm the only one who drives and does everything, like sick as a dog and I still went shopping for groceries. And I also got my security camera. These ones, oops. Can you see that? It's the cop cam, but I just got a cheaper version off eBay. Um, so far it hasn't captured really much. Um, I had I had a look at the footage and um it was it was just the carpet and my footstool and I'm like I don't remember turning it on to do that. So I did turn it on to like record my room just to test it, but I don't know where that footage is, so I don't know. Um and I've seen a, I've read a lot of really bad reviews for cop cams, so I mean that was twenty five dollars. If you're gonna get it, just get a really cheapy one. But I don't think the quality is very good. Like the video, you could see, but I don't know. I was recording and didn't record what I wanted it to record, and it was recording what I didn't want it to record. So it's really weird. 
And then that was Thursday. So then Friday, four, five, six, seven, eight. Friday the eighth. Um, Shane Dawson, Jeffrey Star video. Oh, I did um a video for the um the mini controversy palette, and I think I put it up. Link in description if you want to see. And I also saw the movie The Immortal Life of Henrietta Lacks. Just crazy the way people were used and man manipulated. Um, yeah, that's a very sad movie. Uh, so that was the Friday. And then on Friday the 15th of November, mum had a hospital appointment and she's finishing. she's finished all her treatments, so no more hospital visits. Um, I also ordered the pig mirror on the Friday um, from the Shane Dawson collection um, from Beauty Bay for Christmas and I also um, ordered a Christmas present for my sister so I'm still waiting for that. So hopefully next week that'll come. That'll be really cute. Um, this Friday I don't think I did anything. Um, just been feeling really weak really. Friday, so the weekend, I don't have anything there from the week of the 4th of November, from the week of the 11th of November, I don't have anything for the weekend there, but for the weekend this week, the 23rd of November, um, the last episode of the Jeffree Star series, um, I enjoyed it, I just didn't want it to end, I just want to keep watching more and more, it's a lot of fun to go through. But um, Shane was saying that they're still going to be doing things. So there's still lots more videos coming. And they're also saying that the restock for um, the makeup is the 20, is um, in March. And I'll, I was really surprised by that. I thought it might be a bit sooner. But I'm just really um, surprised that I managed to get a palette and a lot of people who really, really, really wanted it <laughs> didn't get one and they have to wait till March now. So... Yeah, I thought it would be like January maybe they'd be getting back into the swing of things. But I kind of wonder if the momentum is going to have died by then. So I'm not sure. Um, we'll see. I mean, um, I think, they, I think they're going to need to put out some more videos around that time to get that buzz back so that people will go back because I don't know if people may be might lose interest or I don't know. So um, I'm sure they'll figure something out. Um, so I would just wait and see. For me, I really want to get the pig with all the lipsticks in it. Um, that'll be cool. Because I know at the Morphe store in Melbourne, um, they, they are selling the lipsticks. But I want it in the pig head. <laughs> and um, I also managed, I don't know how I've been so like I'm just... Sometimes I can have the best luck. Um, I managed to get one of the jumpers from um, Shane Dawson's um, merch, like the new line that he did with Jeffree Star. And I got one of the pink pig jumpers. Um, very lucky. I wanted a green one, but I didn't have enough money for the green one as well. But I got the pink one and I'm just waiting for that to come. So I think that should come next week as well. Uh, so that would give it two weeks, like two weeks for the pig mirror, two weeks for the jumper. Because it, it only took really, like it felt like forever, but it only took two weeks for the um, uh, the conspiracy palette to come as well. I think everyone's just so impatient to get it. But, yeah, it only took about two weeks to come. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. I only coughed twice, that's pretty good. And then yesterday I finished the lyric video for Wish You Well. So if you're watching this on YouTube, um, get ready, you're going to see the lyric video. Um, I think it's quite ingenious. Sometimes I just go with what I feel and then after I do it, it's like, oh, yeah, this makes sense. Now, this is why I didn't. I didn't even think of it. Um, when you see the lyric video, there's three pictures of me. I've used a Snapchat photo because I've layered up the vocals. So it sounds like there's more of me. Um, so, um, yeah, um, it was a really good idea and I like the picture. So you'll have to wait and see which picture it is and um, have a look. So I'm glad I got that out. So now I've got two more songs that I want to put out that I worked on this year that are almost finished. 
One is called On The Run and I got contacted on um, SoundCloud by someone there and they said, you know, this you'd sound great on this and I wrote to it. And then from someone else, I think was it on Instagram or SoundCloud as well and they said, you know, they'd love to work with me. So um, there's that one as well. So On The Run is a really awesome song and the other one... Um, I think and the other one has got another rapper on it and then me as well. But I just need to work on it because I think I was having a bit of trouble with it. And um, then my parents both got ill. So this is why a lot of the songs are waiting um, to get finished. And I'm taking my time as well because uh, still going through a lot. So it's just easier to do things slowly but surely and get them out. So um, that's it. Like, you know, there's a few things that have been done, mainly a lot of shopping. Um, and my invention has um, been at a standstill because I haven't been well and the man, the um, the designer that is going to make a prototype of my design sent me a contract and the lawyer that I use, I'm not even sure of the, um, the advice they're giving and plus it's $250 an hour and I can't afford that. So um, I have to read through it. And since I haven't been well and I can't sit still and concentrate, I haven't read through it. But next week I'm hoping to be able to sit still and read through it with a clear mind. And I've said to him, look, I'm going to, I might need a, a lawyer to read through it. And he said, it's just a standard sort of contract between an inventor and the prototype designer. So I'm actually going to Google that and see what I can find and get that back on track. And um, yeah, it's going to cost a lot of money to get the prototype made, but I'm hoping once I get the prototype made, then I can find an investor and um, go take some steps from them. I'm going to be taking some quite bold steps. So um, I've got somebody in mind to ask for advice. So not really I don't need their money I just need their advice and they're a very powerful person and they've got um enormous business experience so I'm hoping they're gonna say yes and uh, help me from there so there's a there's a lot happening um trying to get the rest of my songs out get my invention going and um get back into beat making and working more on music and you know feeling better as well so um, a few things going there. Got a bit of a Spanish look going today. I've been watching the Kardashians and I noticed they, like, they've been doing the hair parted in the middle and I thought that looks really nice. So it gives you a bit of a Spanish look. Well, that's all good. So that's it for this week. Thank you for tuning in and listening. Please share with your friends or someone you think would like to hear it. Subscribe, share, comment. Love hearing from you guys. And I will speak to you next week. But stay tuned now for if you're on YouTube, you're going to see the um, video for Wish You Well and maybe on audio I'll just put the song back and you can have a listen to the song again and then hopefully head over to YouTube and I'll put it up, um, usually put it up next Wednesday and I think the song I'll put up on Friday because um, New Music Friday, so Friday is like the day. So audio will go up on Monday tomorrow, um, video will go up Wednesday and the song will go up on um Friday so but if you watch the YouTube uh, podcast you'll see the lyric video at the end of that so that was a bit of a mouthful thanks for tuning in thanks for all your love and good wishes and I will catch you next week enjoy the lyric video bye <laughs>
Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Friends, we never got there. Got off on the wrong foot, all oh well. Things went from bad to that's really, really bad. Then two words and can't go back now. I don't like the way this has turned out. Wish it could be better, but it's not. I hope you find your way to a better place. Cause this is not working, so get out now Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Out, out, get out, out, out. Really selfish from the get-go It was all about you from the start You ruled my equilibrium I never got it back And I knew then and there you had to go Oh, You shattered the peace I had inside me I protected savagely my whole life The way I deal with this is to destroy your whole life don't cry to me, it's your own fault Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out my life. Yeah, I wish you well, but get the hell out. Out.